Good morning, everyone. Happy Thursday to you all. Okay, I do have a word of the day I'd like to share. And today's word of the day is supreme. Supreme is an adjective. The definition is highest in rank or authority. Paramount, sovereign chief. Of the highest quality, degree, character, importance. Greatest, utmost, or extreme. Last or final, ultimate. General Dwight D. Eisenhower was the supreme allied commander during World War II. Synonyms are for foremost and mighty. And my thought of the day is if you really look closely, most overnight successes took a long time. There really is no such thing as an overnight success. Um, it takes a while to be successful and there's lots of failures that come along the way. Okay, so this past Saturday, 24 students participated in the MDCPS North Region Chess Tournament at Hylia Garden Senior High. The top five schools from each region have the opportunity to attend the district finals in April. Students participated in four categories, K1, K3, K5, and K8. It was full of excitement as two, student, two students won all five matches in the K5 category, and in the end brought home two individual and three team trophies. That is amazing. We placed first, in the K-1 category, fourth in K-3 category, first in the K-5 category. Three students play, uh, played in the middle school division and placed in the top 10. The K-5 division is extremely competitive. After the fourth round, we were in second place and only a few tiebreak points away from the first place team, uh, John D. Dubois Elementary. And a huge congratulations to Apollo Para Rodriguez and Alta Rosalie for winning all five matches and participating in the top three individually. This was their personal best in any tournament that they played in. And I'd like to congratulate Miss Icon and I'd like to congratulate the whole chess team. This is so amazing. So first place, K1, this is kindergarten, first grade, Adele Rosalie, Adiana Syed. Francesca Peltano, Serena Descana, Vladislava Leskova, Les, I'm so sorry, Leskova. Fourth place, K3, this is second and third grade, Manuela Palares, Arsene Syed, Alda Ozelli, Mia Perez, Emma Perez, Zion Guzman, Caleb Abreu, Martin Penbaraza. First place, this is fourth and fifth grade, Apollo Para Rodriguez, Alta Rosali, Emiliana Polaris, Aleo Voltano, Siddharth Hanaro, Noah Palma, Violeta 
Palaska and Alexander Levinsky. Again, I'm so sorry if I mispronounced your name. And for middle school, Nicholas Tapia, Yarden Yevda, and Fernando Asiel. Congratulations, guys. This is chess is not an easy game. And you guys did amazing. So I'd like to congratulate all the chess, all the whole chess club and chess team and Miss Iacone. That is awesome. That is pretty, pretty amazing. And here's some pictures that Ms. Iacon share with me that I'd like to share with you guys. So this is our chess club, the trophies. And here they are with their trophies for chess club. So awesome job. Pretty big feet. Okay, so this is from the Annex. This is for Values Matter from the Annex Pursuit of Excellence. Anastasia Marshkano, Emma Philip Blanzo, Luana, 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 Luna Chavez, Hara Cristro, Gabriela Cruzfra, and Mandy Wu. Congratulations, guys. Uh, values Matter is really important. It's for character is so important and you'll see for the rest of your life how important character is so congratulations to the students great job okay so mr watson sent you all uh information about an essay contest so make sure that you are checking your emails mr watson sent you something about an essay contest um and you have a chance you can win some cash prizes so please check your emails for that information Okay, Literacy Week, my favorite week. Um, so today, reading takes you everywhere. You're wearing a shirt of your favorite location. And tomorrow, it's wild about reading. Wear your animal print or a shirt with an animal. So very exciting. Also, if you have any pictures for Literacy Week, uh, please make sure that you are sharing them with me. If you have any pictures for Literacy Week, please make sure that you are sharing them with me. I want to put some a little something together for Literacy Week. So any pictures you have, any um, either of the students reading or doing a reading activity, uh, please share them with me and please send them to me. That would be greatly appreciated. Talent Show. Okay, so I told you where to get your application so you can audition. But I didn't tell you where you, um, what you should do with your applications once you have them filled out. So if you're interested in audition, and auditions are on February 1st, you get your talent show form from the, from the main office, and then you're going to give it to Miss Dorsett in room 223. Again, all talent show forms will go to Miss Dorsett in room 223. You must have a form signed in order to audition. So again, you get your forms from the main office and then send your and then give the your forms completed to Miss Dorset in room 223. Okay, so it is Throwback Thursday. And my Throwback Thursday today are these old computers. These are the original Apple computers. This was an Apple IIc. This is a computer that I had when I was a kid. It was the original ones. Uh, we didn't have the internet. They were just kind of, um, you could do basic things on there. Um, wasn't like computer, like your computers that you have today. You couldn't do all the major things on there like you can do today. But this is what the original uh, computers used to look like. So that is my throwback Thursday. All right, a couple of things. Uh, Steam Day is coming. Steam Day is tomorrow. Steam Day is tomorrow. Uh, so you should be already. If you have any questions about Steam, you can see Miss Pyatt. If you have any questions about Steam, you can see Miss Pyatt, but that is happening tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow, I'm also going to be uh, Ticket Friday. So please stay tuned for that. Also, fourth and fifth graders, if you want to be a part of Art Club, last chance to make sure you get your um, forms into Miss Asmund because she's going to be doing the lottery tomorrow. So make sure that you get all your forms into Miss Asmund uh, if you're interested in being a part of uh, being part of uh, Art Club. 
Um, that is all my announcements. Um, oh, uh, again, I put Sarah on. So Sarah, thank you very much for the PSA. And I hope that everybody has a fantastic day today. Thank you for watching WEXP News. Have fun exploring today. Hi, Ventura Waterways. This school has improved since the first marking period. Kids have gotten so much better since we put up a no bullying rule. You've got to keep it up. Your behavior depends on your conduct, meaning if you behave good, you get a good grade. Your teachers give you a chance to work and to have fun. Take that chance and know that your teachers want the best for you, not the worst. They want you to learn, so try your best, get good grades, and remember, this school is ours and it does not fail.